We continue tracking crime where you live with a rash of burglaries in several Rockingham County neighborhoods over the last month. WHC's Channing Frampton joins us from one of those neighborhoods tonight. Channing, what are people saying about their safety tonight? Well, following the, the recent arrest of that breaking and entering suspect here in Rockingham County, residents living in neighborhoods just like this, just off of Erickson Avenue in the county, they're taking extra steps to make sure that their homes are secure as we head into the evening hours. And we have new details on what they're doing to stay safe. And we, we, we used to not lock our doors a lot when we would go out yeah. just for short trips, but we do that now. It was very unsettling. I was very surprised. Santina Wilson and John Malone react to the arrest of this woman, April Wallace. She's accused of breaking into homes across the county, and the sheriff says there's no guarantee it won't happen again. Something like this you can't always prevent. And while you might think that thieves are going to bust down your door or break through the window to get into your house, that's not always the case. One of the first places they're going to look is under these ledges and under your doormat to see if you have a spare key hidden. And boom, they're inside, ready to steal your valuables. Fortunately, in this case, the alleged thief was caught and faces breaking and entering charges along with grand larceny and property damage. Though this isn't the end of the list of charges for this woman. There will be additional charges placed in the case in addition to what we already have. Because of the threat, people living here say they're ready to protect themselves, even though this is still a pretty quiet place to live. I've never heard anything where we were, people were being robbed or yeah. that it was unsafe. It's a, it's a very uh, safe neighborhood. Now, experts say something else to keep in mind as you're heading out and about to shovel some snow this time of year. Make sure you put these snow shovels away where thieves can't get to them. If you leave them just lying about in your yard, well, they can use tools like shovels and yard tools to actually bust through the window and get into your house if they can't find that spare key. Live in Rockingham County, Channing Frampton, WHSV.